Hey, what's up? It's Kit Tamferner video. Today, we are looking at the uh, latest and the greatest uh, Ocean Grip 2507. This is, uh, I think, the third version. All right, so we are setting this up with the uh, curl cord. This is the bigger size right here. I believe this is the 1400 size. All right, so kind of long, longer than the uh, 800s that we've been using. All righty, and uh, I already have a carabiner set up on this one. And yeah, so comes like this when you buy it. So let's go ahead and uh, take this out. Okay. There's uh, instructions in Japanese right there. Basically, uh, this one actually has a scale. So it has a scale that goes up to 7 kg, so about 14 pounds. Okay, and uh, one side is aluminum, the other side is composite, and the grip right here. Okay, I'm gonna show you. Actually modified, so that that's new, right here. That's not the old style, so that's been replaced to give you a more positive hold on fish and so that it doesn't damage the fish. Now, incidentally, that's also the same for uh, the uh, 2100. So, it is now even better, all right? So it doesn't really damage the fish when it rips, although sometimes it's unavoidable. All right, so this one, of course, has the scale of up to 7 kg. So when I'm fishing around the palm, this would be perfect. And then uh, I could weigh the fish. All right. So especially fishing from shore, this is great. Now the other one, I could use it for offshore, of course, just to control the fish. Okay. Now um, we are going to be mounting this right there. I'm going to show you guys how I do it. The first thing that I have to say is that you have to use the right uh, screwdriver for this. It's a Phillips and it uh, has to be the right size. Otherwise, you're not gonna, well, you're not gonna be happy because you're gonna be damaging this uh, screw right here. And it's stainless steel, uh, especially if you're not in countries where the screws are metric, it's gonna have a hard time replacing those if you damage it, all right? So, um, I've taken one completely off and what I want to do is actually just back down a little bit on this, not take it off as you can see, it just kind of rolls out and then you can take that, okay. Now, each of these are actually kind of bent different, okay, and you're going to have to find the one that's a bit rounded. As you can see here, this is the one that's a bit rounded, this has a sharp turn and then that's what you use to insert like so and then just smartly pop this one okay bang just like that and it goes inside the other one you'll have a hell of a time doing it it's not the way to do it so just find the one that's a bit rounded okay by the way if you're new to the channel this channel talks about the house and why sufficient we cover everything from big game, ultralight, everything in between, including fly fishing. And today, I'm setting this fish grip from Studio Ocean Mark for you, so that you can see how it's done, or at least how I do it. Okay, now, again, it's as easy as putting back the screw, like so. I just hand tighten this press and then turn and that's it it's not coming off and just like that it's easy as that okay we have our coil cord that and that is set up okay it's as easy as that just like that 
Alrighty. Uh, if you have questions, of course, drop them in the comment section. And this is great for shore fishing, even for uh, kayak fishing. Very, very good way to uh, control the fish. So uh, I have two fish grips and uh, two uh, hook removers that I could use and they pair up nicely with each other. Uh, looking forward to be uh, using this in my future trips. Alrighty. So that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Class dismissed.